We are learning more about the future of the Rivers Casino project in Portsmouth. In November, residents voted to bring a casino to the city. Eugene Daniel explains what the next steps are and how the pandemic is presenting new challenges. We look forward to working with you collaboratively to be the first, the first casino to operate here in the state of Virginia. Portsmouth leaders got their latest look at the future of Rivers Casino on Tuesday. Rush Street Gaming says it is still waiting on the Virginia Lottery Board's stamp of approval to break down and get to work. If the Lottery Board uh, enacts what they need to do to allow us to do that, we'll be under construction this summer. Developers expect construction on the entertainment side of the project to take about two years, so a late 2022 or early 2023 opening. That includes the gaming floor, restaurants, lounges, outer entertainment areas, and an event center, but that does not include the planned hotel, which would come at a later date. What's very challenging is trying to figure out what the proper design is for a hotel in the post-COVID world. The facility would be big for the city of Portsmouth, expected to bring in $16 million per year in taxes, plus 1,300 permanent jobs and another 1,400 jobs needed for construction. As you know, this pandemic has exposed the fact that um, per persons need to be making living wages, not just working uh, jobs. With the money expected to come in, council members want a sure bet that the people of Portsmouth will get their piece of the pie, especially given the area's poverty rate. In Portsmouth, Eugene Daniel, 13 News Now. The city of Norfolk is also working on bringing in a casino and resort. That project hopes to have the building up and ready by the end of 2022.